Are you finding yourself extremely lazy and bored during this quarantine season? Uh, duh. Everyone is. Well, what if I told you that there was a product that could help you with all your problems while still maintaining somewhat lazy? Wait, what? Tell me more. Also, who are you? I mean, there's no one in my room and I'm starting to get a little suspicious. Well, I'm that voice that you constantly hear in commercials. But that's beside the point. Okay... The product that can help you solve all your problems is... The pulley! Why did something just appear in my hands? That's the pulley. I was going to explain it before you cut me off. Okay. <laughs> Could you hold the pulley up again, please? You know what? No. Why am I taking orders from a voice? Uh, uh, um... Okay, geez, sorry. You don't have to be rude about it. Continuing! The pulley has a grooved wheel with a string attached to it. It is chiefly used to change the direction of a force. Great job with your demonstration skills, Tori. I'm confused. How did you use this thing? How did you use it a second ago? I don't know. I just saw a string, so I pulled down. That's what you have to do. Oh. Wait, but you said I can lift objects with this thing, and there are no objects attached to the string. We're getting to that point. You see that brush over there? I mean, that one? Do you want to pick it up? No. Well, you can attach the pulley to the brush and use the pulley. Oh, this thing just got so much better. I gotta say, 10 out of 10 for Seth, recommend. I mean, it's just, I know I'm doing the same amount of work to get it to me, but effort-wise, so much easier. Everybody has to have one of these. See, when you use pulleys, it makes lifting objects so much easier, right, Tori? Uh, hello, Earth to Tori. Right? I know, I mean, like... And you can even change your mechanical advantage on your pulley. I can change my mechanical advantage on this? Yep. Quick question, commercial voice. Yes? What is a mechanical advantage? You don't know this? Well, mechanical advantage is how beneficial a machine is. Oh, okay. I think I get it now. So, commercial voice, how do I per se change my mechanical advantage on my pulley? Well, instead of pulling down on your string, switch the direction and then pull up. Okay, that sounds somewhat simple. Let me try it. Okay, so that goes around there. We flip this around. And I think I got a commercial voice. Great! Whoa! You know what? That now makes it even easier. And you see, just then, you had a mechanical advantage of two. This is great. You mean, I'm just loving this. And remember that scrunchie you were using? Uh, <laughs> I lost it. Well, the good news is for you, I have oh. it. You can make stuff appear? Yeah, but that's besides the point. Well, you can use your pulley on that scrunchie, too. I'm already one step ahead of you, commercial voice. I am using my pulley from scrunchie. <laughs> Let's go. And if you call the number at the bottom of your screen right now, this pulley can be yours for zero dollars. Wait, that's my phone number. And if you call in the next ten minutes, we'll even give you this free, portable, incline plane. Whoa, I know what incline planes are. These are cool. I just can't believe you guys mean portable. I mean, you guys should call. This is high quality stuff right here. Well, just in case you don't know what they are. <coughs> hey. Well, incline planes are flat surfaces that are slanted so that one side is higher than the other. They're usually used to lift and lower loads, but like if you wanted to, I guess you could exercise with them. Okay. That is some good arm work put out right there. I'm telling you. And you can also use them as a support to help you lift your books. Wow, that makes carrying books so much easier. I'm standing on it now. Yippee! Fun! Well, I guess you could do that too, because technically it's lifting your body, which is a load. So call now, the number at the bottom of your screen, to get your free portable incline plane and your free pulley. Just call now, and I'm sure you will have no regrets. Yeah, the number is still mine, by the way. You have to explain that to me. Um, hello? 
commercial voice. Where did he go? Commercial voice. Commercial voice? He could have sworn he was commercial voice. <gasps> I had the worst dream. I mean, it was so weird. It was so real. It was in a commercial. 